deep in the Russian countryside, a man has transformed his home into a work of art. He is self-taught and says his work is inspired by life in his village, as well as the nature that surrounds it. From a sculpture of cranes in their nest to walls bursting with colorful paintings, this house is not difficult to spot. The property belongs to Mikhail Korshunov, a self-taught artist living in Severnaya Griva. It's a half-abandoned village east of Moscow. The most striking part of his house is the facade. It's covered with his portraits of Russian leaders. Even his tractor is a work of art. An image of a deer is painted on its side along with its name, Sar Vladimir. People always had some sort of expectation that a master would come, that he would settle disputes. Just as in many folk tales, an old woman waits for the master saying, he will help us, he will build us a new house, and will punish and condemn those who should be punished. We Russians have always been waiting for some sort of help from a czar and to be able to rely on him. So this is my czar. If I don't work through the soil of the vegetable garden with it, no one will help me. Korshinov's house is full of treasures. In his garage, there's a World War II era Renault. His father brought it from Germany as a trophy after the war. And he's also a poet. We hear the echo of the ages which passed, the sound of Damascus steel and earthy moans, and the scream of the cranes from the blue skies we can hear, forever alive. We don't know much about the dead heroes who protected our motherland, whose destiny was given to them and where they died. Korshinov's talents are known beyond his village. He was asked to paint this restaurant in a nearby community. Back in Severnaya Griva, the villagers like him for his talents and generosity. But even with Korshinov and his artwork, the village is fading. Whether during winter or now, Look how beautiful it is here. But this is it for the village. It's dying and dying. I don't know how much longer we will be here, but we've lived here since we were born. Locals believe that if it wasn't for Korshinov, there would be nothing here at all. It's almost as if his art is keeping the village alive. Mm -hmm.